We will see how to use the Textivo script. First of all, you can anchor the script as you wish. It adapts to both horizontal and vertical orientations. To add Textivo to text, you need to select the text layer in your After Effects composition. Then press the first plus button in the Textivo panel. If you do not have a text layer selected, you can click directly on the first plus button in the Textivo panel. This will create a new text layer with the Textivo effect applied. The Textivo effect adds a text animation property called Strength, which is pre-animated. However, since all of the effect's properties are at their default values, nothing will happen. This is normal. To see the text animation, you need to modify the properties that you want to see animated. For example, we can modify the scale parameters. If we set the scale to 0, we will see an animation that goes from 0 to 100 scale. When the strength parameter is set to 100%, the Textivo effect is applied at 100%. When this property is animated, each letter follows with a delay that can be directly adjusted in the Textivo panel. If you set the delay value to 0, all letters will evolve simultaneously without any delay. Conversely, if you set the delay to 25, each letter will follow the movement with a delay of 25 frames. The following parameter allows us to adjust the direction of the animation. You can choose from six different options. The direction parameter allows you to define the direction of the animation. For example, you can choose from inside to outside, or from outside to inside. The from index parameter allows you to determine from which letter the animation will start. If you want the animation to start from the letter X, you should set the index to 3. Finally, you can also choose the random mode for the text animation, which you can modify based on the random seed parameter. Now, I am going to create an out animation. To do this, I will move to the end of the first animation and create a mask to the size of the text using the Ctrl plus Shift plus N shortcut, or through the menu. Next, I will add a new Textivo effect by holding down the Alt key while clicking on the first plus button in the Textivo panel. This will set up the animation keys in the opposite direction, from 0% to 100%. Then, I will adjust the Y value to completely move the text out of the mask. I adjust a few parameters, and there you have it. My in-out text animation is complete. Now you have the basics to use Textivo. Don't hesitate to check out the documentation to explore all the possibilities offered by this tool. Have fun!